Hey everybody, Ed here with the Digital Digest, and today I wanted to share a quick unboxing and first look at the PowerAd 14 Watt Portable Solar Panel Charger. Now this is a unique device because of its rating. At 14 watts, that means at peak performance, you're going to get roughly 2 amps of power out of this device when it's pulling in as much light as it possibly can. And it is designed to be portable. It is cost effective as well, which is part of the reason I'm sharing it with all of you today. And quite frankly, fits the bill for what you'd expect a solar panel to do these days. And in the past, panels of this size generally would be limited to about half this performance. A little bit of paperwork here from PowerAd, and I will include a link to purchase this. Uh, and really, it is, for its price, I would say a pretty solid value. And they do tell you that clearly because this is a solar panel, your wattage is going to vary. You know, you're never going to have an exact rate uh, but I will test it and we will see exactly what it's capable of. As I mentioned before, it's like a nylon Velcro combo. Uh, you can see a little bit of branding here. All of these straps are meant to give you the ability to hook this onto your backpack. So when you're out in the field for the day, whether you're a student, a photographer, whatever you may be, uh, you can basically charge up with this uh, just hanging on the outside of your bag, whatever device you choose. I think a good choice would be uh, a power storage bank of some sort uh, and you can see right there we actually have a pouch for that and then the actual output from the solar panels right here that is that USB key or jump drive appearing device all the voltage is regulated internally in this you can see the rating right here again 14 watts uh, the USB output ranging or excuse me 5 volts 2 amps and they're showing you the wide, wide range of different devices that you can power with this. And because as many of you know, and PowerAd makes them, uh, portable, you know, storage, excuse me, portable charging devices uh, that have high ratings these days will allow you to power just about any device you could possibly want to, whether we're talking about pretty much anything pictured here. Uh, that's part of the value of being able to charge through USB. It really does, uh, in a sense, give you the ability to do just about anything, especially when we start to look at something like this. And this solar panel array that you're looking at right here is going to give you that flexibility to go out in the field, not have any sort of batteries or battery packs for that matter. You may only carry one now instead and constantly be replenishing that and making sure that you're never out of juice. This is a great thing, I would say, whether you're uh, you know, hiking, or really just, as I said before, out in the field, have this in a car, uh, road trip, whatever it may be. If you have available light, this is going to allow you to convert it into power. And when you do have peak lighting, as I mentioned, actually get a decent uh, rate of charge, which is something you will not see from solar panels of this uh, variety. I have dabbled with them in the past for uh, basically keeping a car battery conditioned really was a mixed bag when it came to success. This is a much more well-defined product, in my opinion. The fact that it's even prepared to sit on a bag all day long uh, with some flexibility is really impressive. So uh, I'll be interested to test it out, see how well it performs. It feels like it's well-made. Everything is solid uh, and really thin and lightweight, which is another important thing. You know, if you're going to be carrying this in your bag and the idea here is really that it can power anything with light. Uh, you need it to be thin and lightweight because otherwise you could easily justify carrying a couple of, uh, you know, power battery packs instead of something this large. So it's all going to be about really what fits your lifestyle. This one is definitely for people who are, I believe, going to clearly be exposed to more daylight. Uh, than others. So it's really a matter of what you're in the market for. I think it's very cool. I like to see solar panels, something at home now that will actually charge devices at a decent rate. And that's what this represents. Any questions or comments, please feel free to post them. And of course, as usual, please feel free to subscribe. Later.